Part of Tom's bargain with Old Scratch was that Tom was to use his ill-gotten wealth to serve the aims of his new master. First, Old Scratch asked Tom to become a slave merchant, but that work was beneath even Tom, so he finally agreed to open a loan office in Boston. Business was lucrative, and Tom soon found himself making money hand over fist. The luxuries his earnings afforded him, however, never eased the anxiety he felt knowing someday Old Scratch would come for the rest of his payment. As Tom aged, he turned to religion in the hope that it would spare him from his fate, but no amount of piety could change his natural traits. One day, he was arguing with a client about a debt, and the man accused Tom of making a fortune off him. The devil take me, exclaimed Tom indignantly, if I've ever made a farthing. No sooner had Tom uttered these words than there was a loud knock on the door. On opening it, Tom briefly took in the sight of Old Scratch riding a black horse before being abruptly whisked away, never to be seen again. No one looked for him because they all knew the devil always gets his due.